same throughout the week um but um not this week so for what i'm going to be cooking making is a honey um what is it called teriyaki honey it's called teriyaki honey chicken with some broccoli and that'll just be one and then i also add some like bell pepper and some onion like a little stir fry a rocky stir fry and then my second one will be um like a southwest salad with some salmon on the side so i'll be making that for my lunches this week so i don't know depending it just depends on how many that i can make so i don't know if i do three of this three of that um but the salmon is going right now. It marinated a little bit for about like an hour and a half. And now it's baking. Ooh. But salmon doesn't take very long to, to cook. So, yeah. I think it's time for it to be flipped. So, I'll flip that. And then I'll start making the... That's the thing about these. baking soda I seasoned it beforehand with just salt pepper and some a little bit of seasoned salt and then the reason why I didn't season it as much is because of the sauce that I'll be making which has like honey teriyaki all those stuff have um, like sugar and um, salt in it so don't want to go too overboard so as of right now I just make my stir fry have some avocado oil here. I'm gonna put this. I'm gonna put it to about um, in the middle. We have the gas stove and it gets too hot. But also, I don't really think this pan is that good. These are um, the new pans that we had got um, from Macy's. Mm, not the best. You think, oh yeah, it's from Macy's, so it's probably good. But no, I feel like it burns easier than the. Um, other black pots that we got from Ross. So I chopped up some onions. 
I think I'm gonna need some more onions. So, let that sit a little bit, and then I will chop a little bit of bell pepper. Southwest chopped salad from Trader Joe's. It was like $2.99. Um, so, I'm excited about that. I don't know how many um, meals I can get out of it. I'm thinking three at most, but we will see. So, I have the air fried chicken in here. Um, I'm about to add this. Um, a little bit of soy sauce, honey, and barbecue sauce just on it. Um, and then let it heat up for a little bit. Hopefully it gets a little bit more crispy. Um, but they are pretty crispy from the air fryer. And they were much quicker. So that's what I'm about to do. Hopefully, I don't think I need enough rich sauce. Even though, yeah, I don't think I'm going to add any more sauce. Because I don't want it to be too, too much. So, I wonder if there's anything in here. Okay. And then here's the oh, rice. You guys can't really see it. Let me show you guys. So, yeah. I'll show you guys the end product. Okay, here's the end. Sorry. Let it clear up a little bit. That's the end of it. I will add it on top of these broccoli and then I'll start finishing the other meal which is this salad with the salmon on the side. Here's the end of the three meal preps. Just a whole bunch of broccoli, a bunch of, I don't know what type of chicken this is but like honey barbecue or honey teriyaki barbecue. But yeah, it turned out pretty good. I left a few here just so I can eat with a salad tonight and then yeah. Okay, we got all six meals here. The salmon's on the side just so I can warm it up and not warm up my whole salad. And then the kit also came with some, I think it's called avocado dressing. Um, so hopefully I can manage and it'll keep me. <laughs> I'll be able to use it for just the three. And then it also came with these cubes of cheese and then it came with these tortilla chips. So, there it is. Nice and simple. Hi guys. So today is Monday. It is the 11th. As you guys saw, 
I got back yesterday and I had made my meal prep. Um, so today I'm about to kind of like meal prep some breakfast. I'm kind of gonna make like an egg scramble um, for about maybe three days because you know egg, I don't really like keeping it for that long. But I'm trying something new, I'm gonna make an egg scramble. So I chopped up my, um, I have bell pepper and some onions and then I have a bag of spinach. I got some chorizos, um, and then some turkey sausage, yeah, and then some turkey sausage, and then some egg, I'm going to scrub that up, and then sometimes I'll eat it maybe with some toast, or um, with some waffles, I may make some waffles, I saw this new recipe that I wanted to try, so I'm going to maybe try it out, I'm also, um, working i'm just taking a few minutes to get breakfast done um so yeah i work till 12 today i also have a meeting for my internship um and then i have another meeting with my mentor later this evening um with a um entrepreneur who's in denver um so yeah today is kind of busy um but yeah I'm gonna add some avocado oil. This one got kind of hot. Um, put it down to the end. Then I'm just gonna add, usually you're supposed to add like your um, <laughs> onions first. But you know. Here how it looks before I add the egg. I'm gonna drain some of the juice, just a little bit so it can fry up a little bit, and then I go ahead and add the egg. And yeah, so for the um, waffle mix or pancake mix or whatever, I'll be using um, some applesauce, oatmeal, some rolled oats that I got. I believe some cinnamon. No, it's ginger. Some cinnamon. I forgot what else. Um, I think it's supposed to be some some fruits. Oh, and eggs. Oh, I put the eggs away, so I need to go put the eggs back. So this is the egg scramble and it is so good. The only thing is I'll put a little bit more pepper flakes so it can be a little more spicy but good it has good protein from the turkey and then the spinach. Um, so I feel like this will last me more than maybe like four days because it's kind of a lot. I used five eggs. I could have used four um, but I just wanted to be on the safe side. And then um, I have the waffle here making or whatever it's on the grill <laughs> and the re the what I used it only makes about two the um, actual batter I only used a half cup of um, rolled, o rolled oats and then a half cup of applesauce a little bit of cinnamon one egg and a little bit of almond milk the recipe said two eggs but if you wanted it vegan you could use um, almond milk but I just did half and half because I didn't want to use all our eggs. But yeah, so hopefully the waffle turns out good. Um, try a new um, recipe because I usually use bananas. And this time you don't, 
I was like, how is it going to be like sweet? Because there's no, um, there was no like sh added sugar or like honey or anything to be added. But um, that's okay. I'm going to use honey as my syrup because we don't have syrup. But yeah, I got to hurry up. I have a meeting soon. Um, so just going to go over some things. Um, I'll show you guys my completed breakfast after. So here is my final breakfast. I hope the waffle is good. I'll let you guys know. And yeah. So that's my meal prep. I put um, the other eggs in a container. I use it for a week. Maybe do some toast or just eat a banana or eat some type of fruit. Um, if I don't want to eat like any like carb heavy any, um, anything like that's carbs or anything um, like bread so yeah okay guys so I just wanted to show you guys the complete meal um, it's dinner time right now and I'm eating my salad my chipotle salad with um, some salmon um, yeah this dressing is like supposed to be an avocado dressing i don't know if, i don't really like it like that but i just add a little bit to it i might add some sriracha on it just to get a little kick but yeah <laughs> did you do a day in the life huh well i did a video on like 